What we did today is we put them through several different tests as a little bit of a baseline to see where they stand at the moment so that hopefully through pre-season uh, when we look to retest them again we can see some improvements. So we've had them in doing their heights and weights, uh, we've had them in looking at their power and, and how reactive they are as footballers and uh, we've also done some muscle strength testing particularly around the muscles that frequently get injured and that frequently underpin performance such as hip and groin uh, quads and, and hamstrings. Um, on the pitch wise uh, we've done some tests of speed and acceleration uh, over 5, 10, 20 and 40 meters. Uh, we've done a change of direction test uh, called the 505 which is a 180 change of direction so it's quite intense for them to do to look at their left and, and their right and then we finally finished with a 3015 test and you know some of your viewers might have seen uh, or done a Cooper run or a bleep test or a yo-yo test it's just what that's naturally evolved in and lots of the best football teams in the world now will be using the 3015 uh, to test aerobic capacity the ability of the heart and the lungs and you know certainly seeing the, the players galloping 40 meters and 40 meters back and you know full engagement full effort was was majestic to see